Hello everyone, welcome back to the Science Solution. I'm Janaya. You know, I really love to swim in the ocean, in the ocean. And that is because it's much easier to swim and float in the ocean. It's like the ocean reads your mind and sends you to where you want to go. But in pool water, it's like when you try to float, you sink to the bottom like a rock. So I decided to investigate why this happens. And the reason why is because of density. Now, solids are more dense than, than liquids. And sometimes liquids can become more dense. I'm going to show you how. Now, I'm going to pour water in, a, in these containers. Just about right there. Okay, now I'm going to go to the other container and pour some water just about right there. Now we're gonna get the eggs and measure them to make sure that they're both the same weight. Okay, they're good, they're about the same weight. Now, we're going to put an egg in here, and an egg in here. Now, as you can see, it's just like pool water. So, I'm gonna take an egg out, and I'll put it in here for a little bit. Then I'm going to pour some salt in, and we're going to see what happens. And I'm going to mix it up with the salt and mix the water. that it's floating because the salt made the water denser and that happens because there are atoms inside both the water and in the salt and when those atoms join together they make the water more dense which means the atoms will go on top of each, on top of each other instead of rolling over one another and that's why the egg is floating instead of sinking. Now, let me tell you what this can relate to. You know, the salt water, in some situations, can represent the devil. And, and the, the salt water can represent Jesus. That is because in the salt water, it's, in the fresh water, it's so hard to float and stay above. But inside the salt water, you don't have to worry. You just go to the top. And in the Bible it says that we are the salt of the earth, which means we too have to go and uplift others. Now, what you can do this week is go uplift one of your friends. Or if you're feeling down, you can ask Jesus to help lift you up. I'll see you next time on the Science 